So, good afternoon, everyone. Uh, I'm Diva Darlene Baher, and I'm representing the Hungarian American Enterprise Scholarship Fund. Um, as a HSF fellow, I spent two academic years in uh, Indiana University Bloomington in 2007 and 2008. So, a quick overview about uh, <clears throat> HSF. Uh, our organization can trace back its roots uh, almost 20 years uh, back when the US Congress uh, created several uh, enterprise funds uh, through Central and Eastern Europe uh, to help the democratic transition. Uh, its main purpose was to provide funds and loans and uh, grants, trainings, and any help uh, to Hungarian small and medium enterprises. Um, by the successful and efficient use of its uh, resources, uh, it was able to, to make a significant impact in the Hungarian business society and uh, also managed to, to um, gain financial uh, success. So uh, after its uh, planned 15 years of operation, um, it monetized uh, <clears throat> its assets and uh, returned half of the earnings to the US Treasury and used half of the money to found the Hungarian American Enterprise Scholarship Fund. Um, with a little bit updated mission, um, which is to provide um, the Hungarian students and, and uh, young professionals possibility to, to uh, have uh, internship experience in the US, renowned uh, US uh, companies. Um, and we put high emphasis uh, on the alumni contribution in the Hungarian society and uh, in Hungary's economic uh, development. So we, requ we require three years of residency agreement upon uh, return. So every um, awardee uh, has to stay here and work here and live here for three years. Okay, so we have four programs. Uh, the professional internship program, which provides, provides one year uh, at one of the top uh, American uh, company, the graduate scholarship, which uh, provides financial grants to uh, students, bright students who want to uh, pursue uh, graduate uh, studies in the US, and also uh, the third program, which provides help for individual projects for senior professionals, and also short-term uh, educational uh, grants uh, in the Harvard Business School. Um, Six years of operations, uh, we had 740 uh, applications and we were be able, we was, we was able to uh, provide uh, almost 300 um, awards, uh, mostly science and en engineering, uh, not really uh, humanities or social sciences. I, as a sociologist, am <laughs> an exception. Um, um, and which is, um, so you can see, peak there. Uh, this is where we try to introduce um, academic scholarship, um, but unfortunately it was really short-lived, only one year, because the partner university in the States shifted the focus to Asia, so we have to cancel that. And also you can see the declining curve. It is because of the um, Bologna process, so many people uh, try to pursue further career in the European Union and not the US, so this is a um, challenge for us. Um, also, which is a big success for us, uh, HSF is a um, model for uh, recently uh, created Baltic and uh, Slovakian uh, enter enter <coughs> scholarship funds. So they actually copied our best practices. Uh, and yeah, uh, our alumni uh, organization, um, we have um, happy hour each month. We have a Thanksgiving dinner and a summer picnic each year, and also many uh, informal meetings. And um, we, as the HSF alumni group, we are uh, looking forward to any cooperation and, and networking with all the present and non-present uh, alumni associations. Thank you.